understanding borderline dispute a deep dive into international relations hello everyone welcome back to our channel today we're going to explore a term that often pops up in news related to international affairs and geography borderline dispute this term might sound complex but don't worry we'll break it down together by the end of this video you'll understand what a borderline dispute is, why it happens, and some famous examples from around the world. Let's dive in. A borderline dispute refers to a disagreement between two or more countries over the precise demarcation of their border. Borders are the lines that define the geographical boundaries of countries, and they are crucial for determining national territory, jurisdiction, and the rights to natural resources. Despite their importance, the exact positioning of these borders can be ambiguous, leading to disputes. These disagreements can arise due to poorly defined treaties, natural changes in landscapes, or historical conflicts. Borderline disputes can stem from a variety of causes. Some of the most common include historical claims, one country might claim land based on historical occupancy or treaties that are interpreted differently by the countries involved. Natural resources. Disputes often occur when valuable natural resources, like oil, gas, or water, are discovered near or along a border. Geographical changes. Natural changes, such as the shifting course of a river that serves as a border, can lead to disputes over the new boundary. Cultural and ethnic differences. In some cases, borders drawn by colonial powers or through treaties do not align with the ethnic, cultural, or linguistic makeup of the population, leading to disputes. Resolving a borderline dispute can be a lengthy and complex process. Here are some methods countries use to address these disagreements. Diplomatic negotiations. Countries may engage in talks to peacefully resolve the dispute through mutual agreement. International arbitration. Disputes can be taken to international courts or arbitration panels, where a neutral third party makes a binding decision. Mediation by international organizations. Organizations like the United Nations can mediate disputes, offering solutions to avoid escalation. Bilateral agreements. In some cases, Countries might sign treaties that clearly define the border based on compromise or historical evidence. Understanding borderline disputes helps us appreciate the complexities of international relations and the importance of diplomacy and dialogue in resolving conflicts. We hope this video has shed light on what borderline disputes are and why they matter. Remember, despite the challenges they present, Resolution is always possible through cooperation and mutual respect. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to exploring more interesting topics with you. Stay curious!